if you have looked at a newspaper before, you will notice the structure of the text. It is usually in a way to help you comprehend the information easily. We have the main heading, you have a subheading, you have the body that can be usually made up of paragraphs. If needed, you also have pictures. This isn't just for newspapers, you can find this structure in textbooks, magazines, and so on. So also, look at a web page as a page in a book. We organize the text in such a way that the user can easily assimilate it. For example, if you have a text that has a heading, it's advisable to make this heading big and bold. So once the person sees the web page, instantly the person knows this is a heading and not part of the body. We also have different kinds of headings. The main heading might be big and bold. The subheading might be a little bit smaller, but still bold. HTML allows you to apply all these effects on your text. And we're going to see how we can do that using HTML code.